All right. I'm just going to demonstrate how to use the 6 axis controller to control emulators on your um, HP touchpad running CM7. Applications you'll need are Super Nintendo emulator, Super Gens Lite works great, haven't had so much luck with the other emulators I've tried. You also need to get the 6 axis controller from the market. I believe it's $1.60 and you'll need root to do this. Opening the 6-axis controller application, I'm going to click on Start. It says Bluetooth must be enabled. I'm going to click Yes. I'm going to make sure that Bluetooth is on. Sometimes it takes a moment to turn it on. All right, Bluetooth is on. Granted super user permissions. I'm going to turn on my 6-axis controller. All right. You can see on the screen, possibly it says client connected one. Change input method to the six axis controller. I'm going to minimize this. I'm going to go to the Super Gens Lite emulator. I'm going to start up Mega Man X. I'm going to do a new game. Turn up the volume. Alright, do it this way so you can kind of see the commands that I input and what happens. Start game. So, I'll just explain a little bit about this. Uh, basically, you can have up to four PS3 remotes connected at the same time. Uh, you'll need to set them up with a uh, computer so that you can map the Bluetooth address to them. Um, it's very easy to do. It just takes a few minutes. Um, it's very good response using the controller. Um, not really any lag. Uh, for some reason, like I said earlier, some apps work better than others, some emulators do. Um, it's very interesting that some work and some don't. I don't really understand why that is. I'd love to learn why though. But there's just no lag. Um, it's really a lot of fun playing the older games on the touchpad. I always wanted to do this with my phone, but I was never able to because the way Samsung implemented Bluetooth on it. But I would highly re recommend checking this out. I'll post everything you need to do it in the description. So, alright. Hope you enjoyed this video. If you have any questions, feel free to post a comment.